Hola mis amores! Good morning! Buenos dias! Welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for stopping by and checking out this August planner setup. I'm going to be setting up my fun mega happy planner today for the month of August. So I'm going to be switching out all of the months um, for all of my eight planners that I have in here. I just have uh, the months for the previous month which is July and I'm gonna be switching all of these out putting them back into their the, the planners that they came from and then putting in all of the new um, the new August months for this upcoming month or I guess the current month because it is currently August the second so exciting so if you're interested in seeing what I do here I just keep on watching All right, so um, if you're familiar with my Happy Planner solar system, you know that I have two mega planners, and this one's my functional one. It's in the colorful leopard with these gorgeous teal expander discs. And then I have my fun mega happy planner, which is um, in this jungle vibes cover with these gorgeous alternating hot pink and lavender metallic discs. So my functional planner is, um, it has a lot of my serious stuff in it, my work, budget, household, my community service work. And then my fun planner, this guy here, has all of my fun stuff in here. And these are less planners and they are like workbooks and journals and just a space for me to be really, really creative and uh, just have fun. So this planner is, of course, the Jungle Vibes color block planner that was released in that whole spring release. I still haven't decorated the cover page. I always take forever decorating my cover pages, and so I might do this while I'm on vacation, actually. So I'm going to be on vacation starting tomorrow through August 13th, so I'm going to be probably decorating a lot in my planners. So I actually haven't decorated any of the weeks or the monthly um, spreads for these for this upcoming week and the month of August because I figured I might as well do it while I'm on vacation and um, I was so busy uh, just prepping for my vacation trying to get everything done and get all my affairs in order before I left for almost two weeks well I guess it's a week and a half um, so I figured I might as well just decorate them while I'm on vacation so yeah, let's get this uh, mega planner all set up here. So I have my uh, calendar, which I don't really use too much, but I've been wanting to use it more. So I've decided that instead of like writing things kind of in advance, I come, I'm going to use these pages more as like a memory keeping thing and like kind of casually decorate them. So uh, I'm going to pop in this bookmark here to just to mark the spot. I got these bookmarks at Joann's over the weekend and they were actually are meant for a big happy planner but I just cut them down to size and then uh, decided I could use them like that. So there we go. And then I have um, just this July overview page that just I just decorated um, because it, the back of it is, you know, the back of it is the end of the perpetual calendar. I can't really do anything with this page. So I just end up decorating these pages and, um, and yeah. And actually, I'm going to go ahead and just decorate with some washi tape really quickly here. I got this washi tape in Little Tokyo um, over the weekend and I am so obsessed with it. It's got this like super cute... Um, dessert theme very cute oh, gorgeous gorgeous all right so anyways so I got my little Mickey envelope here I have a folder with some stickers from the new Oasis collection love this collection my sticky note dash that's gonna stay in here I have another folder with some stationary stationery in there that's gonna stay in there and then I have some filler paper, some blank filler paper in the various styles. And then I have some wellness pages in here as well. That's all going to stay in here. And then we get into my first monthly section, my first planner. And this is my gardening planner. And I'm going to go ahead and pull out this month, the month of July, and put it back into the planner it came from, which is this guy, the Feel All the Feels. So June, let's skip to July, pop this one in here, 
and I have the month of August in this um, planner over here so I'm just gonna pull it out and pop it in this is a cute cover celebrate your small victories so I'm gonna grab my bookmark and pop it in here in the first week there we go and so there we have my August gardening planner all set up then I just have my little envelope here for photos I have a scrapbook paper with some stickers on it and then I have my um, I have my July overview which I just realized since I put these stickers on the back of it I'm gonna have to leave this July overview in here and then this is my meditation journal my mindfulness workbook and um, I'm gonna have to leave this page in here because it has the August overview on the back but I'm gonna take out this month and I'm gonna pop it back into the planner it came from so let's see let's pop this back in here this planner is so gorgeous I'm shocked I don't see that many people using this one because it is so beautiful and then the August month is this guy here with this beautiful breathe font on it so there we go um, I like the color palette for this month I like the orange and the green so there we go and then we have the September overview I'm gonna grab this bookmark and move it to the first week of August perfect so that is oh and then this guy I'm going to move back to the front here. There we go. So then that's all set up. Uh, I'm so excited to get into these new months. And then we have my next section, which is my journaling section. And um, I use the, a horizontal layout for my journal. I'm going to leave this page in because it has the August overview in it. But I'm gonna pull out. Um, oh, and again, I just realized I'm gonna have to leave July's uh, the July overview in here as well because it's the back of it is the scrapbook paper I used to separate the sections. Oh well. And I actually already have the month of August in here, um, so. I'm just going to pull these pages out and then move them. And I'm not going to add September in here because my happy planner is already thick enough and I already started decorating the monthly. So there we go. I'm going to add this in here. And then I'm actually going to switch out this bookmark uh, for this bookmark here. This was... Um, a, actually a bookmark meant for a big and I just cut it down to size but I like the pencils on it and I'm just gonna grab a label from my colorful boxes and add it here at the top I'm just gonna put journal and then we have uh, that's and that's all set up so these pages are from the uh, press florals horizontal so this planner here and then we have my next section, which is a, this is my colorful leopard lined vertical planner. And I use this for current events. I like listening to the news and I like kind of journaling about what I hear. So these are all of my um, previous spreads. And I'm gonna leave this page in because it has the August uh, overview on it, but I will take out my July, the month of July. And I'm gonna leave this page in here as well because it has the scrapbook paper on the back and I'm actually gonna fill this out on my vacation I'm still debating how I want to use the July monthly overview for this particular planner because it is my current events section and I'm gonna pop these pages back into my colorful leopard planner which because I'm using the cover for my other mega planner I actually don't have this with a cover on it it's just kind of naked sitting in my planner stash um, which is fine I suppose 
and then I'm gonna grab my August monthly or I guess my, my August for the colorful leopard and I'm gonna pop it in here so we have my July my August and then my August pages I love that um, it alternates between this like beige and pink and then we have the September uh, overview at the end and for my bookmark I think I'm gonna go with let's see I have three bookmarks I like this one I'm gonna go with this one the just bloom page and I'm gonna peel off this fitness sticker then I have my next section which is my uh, language section here's my scrapbook paper and the Sun is coming up so I'm gonna have to move soon hopefully I'll finish this video before the light gets too distracting but let's see I'm gonna pull out my July monthly except for this last week because I'm still working on this last week so I'm gonna pull out this July these pages I'm gonna leave in these pages and because I'm still working on them, I'm gonna leave in the August. And I actually already have my August, uh, the month of August in here. So I'm just gonna leave that. I love this, um, this cover here. And I'm gonna use, I'm gonna keep this bookmark here, the pink one. I'm gonna keep this one. I like it a lot for this section. Okay, I tried shifting a little bit. Hopefully the lighting is a little bit better and the sun isn't casting all those weird shadows on my planner. But um, as I was saying, I already have the month of August in here, so I just can leave that in there. And then moving on to my reading journal, um, I'm going to pull out the month of July, which I'm happy to see this one go because I don't like this, fold, this divider very much. Um, I'm gonna pull out, I'm gonna leave this page actually because it has the August overview in it. I'm gonna grab my Welcome to the Book Club planner that these pages came out of. Pop these bad boys back in. I'm gonna grab the next month here and pop it into the rings. So I really like this cover. Um, yeah, I'm happy with that. I still like this bookmark for August, or for my reading journal. So I'm just gonna leave that in there. And there we have my reading journal. Then we have a, a scrapbook paper separating it from my next section, which is my YouTube section. And let's see. This is, um, these pages are the ones that came with this uh, Jungle Vibes planner and um, I'm gonna leave in this last page because it has the August overview and I already have August in here so all I need to do is pull out these pages and put them back into the planner that it came from I'm gonna leave this oh I'm gonna move this bookmark and I actually kind of want to change this bookmark um, up so I'm gonna put this one in with the daisies I'm gonna give it a label and then write for lizard on on it this time I used a sparkly green gel pen <laughs> and then yeah so that's my August and then we have my next section which is my memory keeping section and it's about time I took out June out of here so I like keeping two months of my memory keeper in here because I just like looking through it and seeing all of the pictures I took and all the awesome memories I've made and I just like having um, two months in here so I'm gonna leave in July but I am gonna take out June and these pages actually came from an undated extension pack so I've been putting them into this uh, catch-all uh, planner I guess is what I call it it has like a bunch of random stuff in here a bunch of filler paper wellness pages things like that and I might eventually just put all of my memory um, my memory spreads into like its own planner but for now I'll just leave it in there um, so these pages were from an undated extension but then I got a, an actual planner this is um, the I forget what it's called but it's like a realistic floral type planner I got this one to um, to memory keep in because it is 
and this one was a, a vertical format so I'm gonna leave this the month of July in here because like I said I like having two months in here so now that it's August I'll leave in July um, July was an awesome month and I have a lot of great memories so yeah these are all of my memory keeping spreads I still need to decorate this last month in here and I'm gonna pull out this bookmark and I think I'm gonna add I think I'm gonna use this bookmark for this section I'm actually planning on um, decorating this week on camera like I'm gonna film a plan with me for this section and then I have to add in the month of August and the pages from this section came from this planner here with the you are made to bloom on it but I actually am using that for something else so the pages are actually kind of naked right now so this is the month of August for this planner your future looks bright it says I love that so I'm gonna pop it in here and as you can see it's all blank I love that it's light pink this month is the accents are light pink love that and um, yeah so I think that's it I've set up this entire mega planner that's eight different planner sections in here really happy with how it turned out I'm excited to get into all of these spreads and just decorate to my heart's content and I have two bookmarks left here so I kind of just want to pop them into some places um, and just to have them in here so I think the let's see uh, where where should I pop them into maybe I'll pop one in here and like to mark my filler my filler paper so I'll pop that in there and then I'll pop this one into here for my wellness section and there we go my second mega planner my fun mega planner is complete and she feels a little thinner with a couple of a uh, couple of things taken out of her so uh, yeah i'm excited to get into all of these new months and yeah oh, i love setting up my planners i love watching planner setup videos they're one of my favorite videos to watch all right everyone thank you so much for tuning in let me know if you enjoyed this planner setup and your thoughts in the comments down below and i will catch you in my next video bye